Hey, this is Tony Ross for TonyTeach.com, and this is going to be a semi-quick little tutorial slash answering of the question, and it's a very controversial question, but I'm brave enough to answer it. Uh, this comes from one of our viewers, and they said, hey, which Tomb Boom Harmony version should I get? Okay, so am I going to tell you which version to get? No, but I'm going to give you some advice that might help you make that decision on your own. Anyway, so I'm going to jump over here to, let's see, Harmony Essentials. Now, Harmony comes in three different versions. There's Harmony Essentials, Harmony Advanced, and Harmony Premium. Um, now, quick thing is, if you're coming from a flash background, in my humble opinion, even the bottom of the line, Harmony Essentials would be able to blow flash out of the water. And if you're saying, but no, the new flash or excuse me, animate has some new tools and that's great. Awesome. Um, no, no, no offense to flash slash Adobe animate, but I want to ask this question. Where is the camera? That question alone, um, in my opinion, puts it worlds ahead. Speaking of that, I think that's the tutorial I'll do tomorrow. I'll do one on the camera. Uh, but today, let's talk about what you can do in Harmony Essentials. Uh, I've got my little cat guy here. I haven't actually fully separated him, uh, but I've got several layers. I just got the body and everything like that, but I decided to put his arms on their own separate layers. And if you notice, I'm selecting the right arm now, so everything else is kind of frosted out. So what I want to do is I want to show you the deformation tools that are here. So this is kind of which harmony should I use, but it's also I want to talk about some of the deformers. Um, so what I'll do, I'll come up here to the top of my screen, go to my rigging tool, and inside of Essentials, you basically have uh, the bone deformer tools or the bone rigging tools. There's regular bones and there's game bones. I'm not doing a game with this. I'm just going to do a normal bone. So I'm going to click where I want the start to be, right up here at the top, and go about to where I want the elbow to be, and then right down here at the paw. Now, if you look, this large circle in the middle, this is called the articulator. So by default, you should have it a little bit larger so the arm can bend and it's, that's where it's going to deform. So that is what I just did. I'm going to go down here to my transform tool and I can move. Hey, dude, that arm's moving pretty cool there. And I can even rotate the arm. Do, 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 do. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um, now, I'm going to undo that. So let's go back here to my rigging tool. And I'm going to make this articulator a lot larger. And that's going to give me more of a rubber hose type bend. Yeah, yeah. And I know what you're thinking, but can you animate it? Yes, you can animate it. Let's see. Let's undo that. Uh, let's give our arm here. And our other little thing. Let's give them some extra space. Let's take it all the way up to frame 60. Let's do F6. Excuse me, F5. All right. Turn on my animate button. And let's drop in. We'll drop in a keyframe. We'll do F6. And let's say by frame 20, we'll just bend the arm up and a little bit over. All right, he's putting his arm under there. That's a little weird. Mainly because I haven't actually brought anything forward yet. Matter of fact, let's do something interesting. Uh, the other arm is actually in front of that. So let me show you another reason I like working with this. I'm going to select my arm here, make sure my animate's off. And I need this arm to be in front of the other one. So I'll just do Option, Alt and PC, and press the down arrow once. 
boom. And the down arrow, think about it as pointing toward you or pushing, pointing toward you. So I said, bring the arm toward me. So now that arm bends a little bit better. Anyway, so uh, I'm rambling, but that's the bone deformer. This is in Harmony Essentials. It is the bottom of the line. Uh, so I just did a couple of things. I just did the bone tool. I also changed where something was being brought to the front without having to change my layer order. Uh, that's some of the minor things that the reason I actually switched over from animating in Flash to animating in Harmony. Okay. Now, let's jump over to Harmony Premium. Now, I'm not going to do advanced, but I am going to do the, I think the biggest, I want to do the night and day. So it's like, here's the bottom line. This is the top of the line. In case you're not familiar with Harmony Premium, Harmony Premium is responsible for things like, uh, let's say, episodes of The Simpsons, uh, Family Guy, Bob's Burgers. All of those are working in Harmony and a lot of things that are in Disney. So what I want to do here, let's turn off my animate button. I'm going to go to my rigging tool and in Harmony Essentials, we only had the bone tool. So it was, we had bone or the game bone. Harmony Premium, we have the bone, we have the curve mode, and we even have an awesome thing called the envelope mode, which will be another lesson. But what I want to talk about real quick is the curve mode. So for the curve mode, if you're familiar with working with programs like Adobe Illustrator and working with Bezier curves or Bezier curves, however you want to say it, uh, what I'm going to do here is click at the top and I'm going to just drag straight down a little line, let go, and I'll click at the bottom paw and drag straight up and let go. So what I'll do now is go to my transform tool and what this tool does is pretty much some really awesome little curves because it is boom, doom, 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 a curve deformer. This deformer is only in Harmony Premium and in a word, it is a beast. It is really awesome. So just imagine how much work you can do, like not having to redraw any of the stuff. And then, of course, matter of fact, let's do some animation with this. We'll close that down. Let's go to frame 60. Let's extend. Let's do F5. And da, 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 da. we'll drop in a keyframe, F6. And let's say by, oh yeah, let's turn on our animate button. And we'll start to change what we want this to do. Maybe even bring this forward. Okay. Now, just to show you how cool this program is, uh, I'm going to do one last little fun thing. Like, his arm goes there. That's great. Uh, let's copy that first keyframe. Command C. Let's go over here just a few frames later. Command V. And then what I want to do is copy this other keyframe here where his arm goes behind this other arm. That's what we had in the other one, yeah. So I'm going to copy that keyframe. Command C, let's control C on PC, and we'll paste it again, Command V, but here's the fun part. What I wanna do here, see if I can do this, select our little arm here, and this time I want it to do, I want it to be in front, so I'm gonna hold on my Option key, press the down arrow. Oops, let me do one little thing here. Select that artwork. Hold on my option key, press the down arrow. Thank you. All right, so I'm just scrubbing back through this. So the animation, he goes under the arm, pulls back, then he goes over the arm. Okay, 
Now, don't get me wrong. That little thing where we did, hey, this time it's under the arm, this time it's over the arm, that can be done in Harmony Essentials, Advanced, and Premium. So even on the bottom of the line, you can do that so you can actually move backward and forward on your Z axis or your Z axis. You can move that backward and forward and animate it. It's kind of cool. But the Curve Deformer... This little thing that um, gave us all that really nice movement there and curves that is only let's say that is only in premium harmony premium so that being said I'm gonna jump over here back over here to Chrome um, so, because Harmony used to be quite pricey, what they did, um, starting with version 12, I think it was version 12, uh, where they actually started saying, okay, well, we can do things in a monthly fee. So you can pay monthly, annually, or if you say, dude, I don't want to do any kind of subscription, you can actually just buy it straight out. So when you first go to the site, it's showing you annually, but what if I want to do this monthly? So essentials would cost you $23 a month or the advance would be $58 a month. Premium is $109 a month. And if you want to do this annually, um, it would be $180 for the year, $456 for advance for the year, and $876 for premium for the year. And if you want to buy it straight out, um, you're just going to and click buy. Um, and those are your prices. Now, if you're thinking, dude, Harmony Premium is really expensive. That's if you're trying to buy it straight out. And don't get me wrong. Um, even if you go monthly, it's still $109 a month. If you're doing this as a hobby and money is no expense, um, dude, go for premium. You can do a lot of things with that. And if you're just... Um, trying to get in the business if you say i want to actually do some work and get picked up by some different agencies or different studios you're probably going to have to go with premium for that because that's what they're going to be using so uh it depends on what you want to do so that's my answer i am kind of running a political race here and going i'm not going to tell you which version uh, but those are some of the things you need to think about uh i kind of do tutorials and I also do a lot of uh, freelance so I usually do whatever it calls for like if if my client is paying me well enough then okay cool I can use premium and uh, get a lot of those little shortcuts there so it's kind of cool um, that being said I'm rambling again I uh, wanted to let you know we are about to release our next title and this is going to be using harmony 14 it covers versions 12 and 14 yes they skipped 13 um but mastering lip sync in tomb boom harmony it's going to be releasing on september 12th and we're going to be talking about a lot of stuff like how to use sync layers uh using the script pose copier which is available in essentials advanced and premium and working with things like uh, the deformers with lip sync and even some things on what we do to record our voices when we're getting ready to do animations. So uh, if you grab that right now, this week, it is going just for 49. Uh, next week, it goes to 79. And the week after that, it goes to its permanent price of 99. So anyway, enough about that. This has been Tony Ross for TonyTeach.com. Remember, keep it simple. Make it perfect. If you don't have time to make it perfect, rethink the idea. Have a good one.